Nixon in China is one of the greatest operas of the last 50 years. It's been produced around the world and now it's coming to Denmark. At spille Nixon i Nixon in China, det er første gang, at jeg portrætterer en person, som rent faktisk har eksisteret, og ikke bare har eksisteret, men som også er et ekstremt veldokumenteret menneske. I mean, most of the characters that, that we create on stage are fantasy, or from a period in history that was so long ago, you know, there's not that immediate um, connection to them. In, yes, in some ways it's, it's great to be able to look at her and see how she moves and the way in which she speaks and the way that she expresses herself. But at the same time, it's, yeah, it's slightly intimidating. <laughs> what I love about opera is that it works on so many different levels. It has a political dimension, it has an emotional dimension. This piece, of course, has an enormous political conversation, but it's also an emotional opera. It's about what it feels like to be the President of the United States, what it feels like to be running China. And what we discover about these people is how extraordinarily powerless they feel. Nixon in China handles about how some real people have it in a very important and important complicated event. And I think it's absolutely true. It's not that different from a lot of things that are going on now. And I think a lot of the story is very human and it's very accessible and it's very relevant still and, and beautiful. It's really, the language is beautiful, the music is fabulous. A great way to spend a few hours. 